and good day. My name is Jürgen Steinmetz from eTurbo News, and this is a breaking news update. For more news updates and shows, please go to youtube.com slash travel news group, youtube.com slash travel news group. Here's our update. Hawaii hotels see decrease in revenue and occupancy. Hawaii's hotel industry saw a decrease in September rev par and occupancy statewide compared to September 2019, in part due to the effects of the Delta variant that stymied travel demand. Hawaii hotel rev par down 13.5% in September 2021 compared to September 2019 due to lower occupancy. Hawaii hotels are still leading the nation in rev par and ADR. Through the first nine months of 2021, Hawaii hotel performance statewide continued to be impacted by the COVID-19 pandemic. Hawaii hotels statewide reported substantially higher revenue per available room, rev par, average daily rate, ADR, and occupancy in September 2021 compared to September 2020 when the state's quarantine order for travelers due to the COVID-19 pandemic resulted in dramatic declines for the hotel industry. When compared to September 2019, statewide ADR was higher in September 2021 but rev par was lower due to less occupancy. According to the Hawaii Hotel Performance Report published by the Hawaii Tourism Authority HTA, statewide rev par in September 2021 was $168 plus 442.6%, with ADR at $304 plus 102.7%, and occupancy of 55.2% plus 34.6 percentage points, compared to September 2020. Compared with September 2019, rev par was 13.5% lower, driven by lower occupancy, minus 23.8 percentage points, which could not be offset by increased ADR, plus 23.7%. Hawaii's hotel industry saw a decrease in September rev par and occupancy statewide compared to September 2019, in part due to the effects of the Delta variant that stymied travel demand, said John DeFries, HTA president and CEO. This reminds us that the pandemic is not over and we must remain vigilant to keep our communities safe and economic recovery on track. The report's findings utilized data compiled by STR, Inc., which conducts the largest and most comprehensive survey of hotel properties in the Hawaiian Islands. For September, the survey included 144 properties representing 46,094 rooms, or 85.4% of all lodging properties and 86.0% of operating lodging properties with 20 rooms or more in the Hawaiian Islands, including those offering full service, limited service, and condominium hotels. Vacation rental and timeshare properties were not included in this survey. In September 2021, passengers arriving from out of state could bypass the state's mandatory 10-day self-quarantine if they were fully vaccinated in the United States or with a valid negative COVID-19 NAAT test result from a trusted testing partner prior to their departure through the Safe Travels program. On August 23, 2021, Hawaii Governor David Ige urged travelers to curtail non-essential travel until the end of October 2021 due to the Delta variant resulting in the state's health care system being overburdened. Hawaii hotel room revenues statewide rose to $270 million, plus 908.7% versus 2020, minus 13.2% versus 2019, in September. Room demand was 887,100 room nights, plus 397.6% versus 2020, minus 29.8% versus 2019, and room supply was 1.6 million room nights, plus 85.9% versus 2020, plus 0.4% versus 2019. Many properties closed or reduced operations starting in April 2020 due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Due to these supply reductions, comparative data for certain markets and prices classes were not available for 2020, and comparisons to 2019 have been added. Luxury class properties earned rev par of $308 plus 1,364.2% versus 2020, minus 4.7% versus 2019, with ADR at $664 plus 149.9% versus 2020, plus 45.6% versus 2019, and occupancy of 46.4%, plus 38.5 percentage points versus 2020, minus 24.4% points versus 2019. 
Midscale and economy class properties earned Rev par of $159 plus 273.1% versus 2020, plus 23.7% versus 2019, with ADR at $281 plus 147.3% versus 2020, plus 77.0% versus 2019, and occupancy of 56.4%, plus 19.0 percentage points versus 2020, minus 24.3% percentage points versus 2019. Maui County Hotels led the counties in September and achieved Rev Par that surpassed September 2019. Rev Par was $289 plus 958.5% versus 2020, plus 25.2% versus 2019, with ADR at $488 plus 233.1% versus 2020 plus 54.4% versus 2019, and occupancy of 59.2%, plus 40.6 percentage points versus 2020, minus 13.8 percentage points versus 2019. Maui's luxury resort region of Wailea had rev par of $366 minus 3.5% versus 2019, with ADR at $682 plus 48.1% versus 2019, and occupancy of 53.7% minus 28.7 percentage points versus 2019. The Lahaina, Kaanapali, Kapalua region had Rev Par of $258 plus 1828.6% versus 2020, plus 30.0% versus 2019, ADR at $416 plus 208.1% versus 2020, plus 50.6% versus 2019, and occupancy of 62.0%, plus 52.1 percentage points versus 2020, minus 9.8 percentage points versus 2019. Kauai Hotels earned Rev Par of $209, plus 812.3% versus 2020, plus 26.2% versus 2019, with ADR at $316, plus 107.9% versus 2020, plus 32.8% versus 2019, and occupancy of 66.1%, plus 51.1 percentage points versus 2020, minus 3.4 percentage points versus 2019. Hotels on the island of Hawaii reported Rev Par at $172, plus 530.0% versus 2020, plus 12.8% versus 2019, with ADR at $307, plus 137.6% versus 2020, plus 38.7% versus 2019, an occupancy of 56.0%, plus 34.9 percentage points versus 2020, minus 12.9 percentage points versus 2019. Kohala Coast Hotels earned Rev Par of $246, plus 19.5% versus 2019, with ADR at $476, plus 54.1% versus 2019, and occupancy of 51.6%, minus 15.0 percentage points versus 2019. Oahu Hotels reported Rev Par of $110, plus 214.6% versus 2020, minus 42.8% versus 2019. In September, ADR at $212, plus 36.3% versus 2020, minus 6.2% versus 2019, and occupancy of 51.8%, plus 29.4 percentage points versus 2020, minus 33.1 percentage points versus 2019. 19. Waikiki Hotels earned $104, plus 243.4% versus 2020, minus 46.0% versus 2019, in Rev Par with ADR at $199, plus 30.6% versus 2020, minus 11.1% versus 2019, and occupancy of 52.0%, plus 32.2 percentage points versus 2020, minus 33.7 percentage points versus 2019. Through the first nine months of 2021, Hawaii hotel performance statewide continued to be impacted by the COVID-19 pandemic. 
Hawaii hotels earned $177 in Rev Par, plus 49.0% versus 2020, minus 22.3% versus 2019, with ADR at $317, plus 16.5% versus 2020, plus 13.0% versus 2019, and occupancy of 55.9%, plus 12.2 percentage points versus 2020, minus 25.3 percentage points versus 2019. Total statewide hotel revenues for the first nine months of 2021 were $2.5 billion, plus 110.8% versus 2020, minus 25.5% versus 2019. Room supply was 14.1 million room nights, plus 41.5% versus 2020, minus 4.1% versus 2019, and room demand was 7.9 million room nights, plus 81.1% versus 2020, minus 34.0% versus 2019. In comparison to the top U.S. markets during the first nine months of 2021, the Hawaiian Islands earned the highest rev par at $177, plus 49.0%. Miami, Florida was second at $143, plus 52.3%, followed by New York, New York at $101, plus 29.8%. The Hawaiian Islands also led the U.S. markets in ADR at $317, plus 16.5%, followed by Miami, Florida at $216, plus 8.1%, and New York, New York at $182, plus 16.6%. With the U.S. mainland accessible for road trips and short-haul intercontinental flights, the Hawaiian Islands' occupancy continued to be lower than many destinations in STR's top 25 markets, landing at the 11th spot. Tampa, Florida topped the country in occupancy at 68.9%, plus 17.4 percentage points, followed by Miami, Florida at 66.1%, plus 19.2 percentage points, and Norfolk, Virginia Beach, Virginia at 63.6%, .6 plus 13.7 percentage points. Hotels in the Maldives ranked highest in Rev Par for International Sun and Sea destinations at $337 plus 46.2%, followed by French Polynesia $315 plus 29.9%, and Maui County $303 plus 81.9%. The island of Hawaii, Kauai, and Oahu ranked 4th, 6th, and 9th, respectively. French Polynesia led in ADR at $718, plus 30.1%, followed by the Maldives, $656, minus 11.7%, and Maui County, $517, plus 26.1%. The island of Hawaii, Kauai, and Oahu ranked 5th, 6th, and 9th, respectively. Puerto Rico led in occupancy for Sun and Sea, destinations at 63.7%, plus 30.1 percentage points, followed by Maui County, 58.7%, plus 18.0 percentage points, and Hawaii Island, 58.4%, plus 12.1 percentage points. Kauai and Oahu ranked 5th and 6th, respectively. Thank you for listening to our news update. There's more on youtube.com slash travel news group. Or you can read us, of course, in going to our news portal at etobernews.com or travelnews.online.